What's up guys, it's your boy Ace coming at you again with another Madden tip and today we're going to be talking about a play that complements the one play touchdown we went over yesterday which was, let's see if I can find it, hold on, seems HP option, cover three, one play touchdown, I posted it yesterday so if you're interested in that, check it out after you watch this video, but this play today is going to be not a one play touchdown but it is easy to read and you have two really good routes on it. You have C route and a post route. But before I get into that, just another reminder that I am about to be starting up my second league of the Madden season. Uh, looking for Xbox One players. Got a few more spots. I think actually three spots to be exact. I'm looking for people who fit a specific mold. So if you're interested, email me at acemaddentips at gmail.com or just comment in this video and I will reach out to you. But those spots will probably be gone by tomorrow so if you're interested get in on it while you can and let's get into the play so wide receiver corners and we're just gonna do random so there's a lot you can do with this I wish that the post route went further down the field I wish it had more depth on it but we'll just make do uh, the post route is really not the main part of the of the um, play it's really the C route and a couple things we can do here is we can put A on a drag and put B on an out route. What that's going to do is against match coverage, we're going to get Y, our post route, open on that side of the field. So A and B clear those out. And then uh, we're going to be looking, you know, most of the time our first read is going to be the C route, which is X. And the only time X will not be open is whenever they're in like a cover two sync type deal. The way you'll be able to tell that it's a cover two sink is if the cornerback that is on X right now, he kind of squats and reads the quarterback's eyes the whole time. He doesn't turn his back or anything. He just kind of has his body towards the quarterback at all times. That's when you're not going to throw it. You're going to probably throw it to your drag route. So let's see what happens here. To man coverage. Most of the time he's going to get clear separation there. Uh, depends on what kind of cornerback is there. But it was Brandon Flowers. He should get more separation than that uh, again it was about a 10 yard gain nothing amazing uh, try to pass lead towards the sidelines and you'll have more success there so right there the curl to flat was pressing the post that's what allows us to get the C route open there we go I mean that was uh, goal line but that'll happen against zero coverage man coverage So I want you to pay attention right here. At first, I think it was zone coverage. Let me make sure. Yeah, so it's zone coverage, but it's a match coverage. So this guy ends up getting manned up on the linebacker. He gets bracketed, so that's obviously not going to be something you want to throw to. But this guy, if you just look long enough, he will like eventually you know, turn his back, and that's when you know he's officially manned up. And then he gets beat when he breaks back outside. So just be uh just get used to running this play and just kind of realizing what that cornerback is doing. Right there he manned up again. You're gonna get him most of the time. I mean sometimes the cornerback will break it up. So right here, that was where the, the cornerback scared me a little bit. He kind of did that cover two sink uh type animation. And I had to dump it down to Kelsey. That's okay. We'll still get a you know decent size uh, gain right there. Kelsey's good. He'll get another first down. So it's kind of a high low read between the C route and the drag. And I'll show you the post in just a second. You know the the post is going to get open against the man coverage and then uh, against match coverage he'll get open on that side of the field. So this is a blitz. If it's a cover three blitz, it will automatically be match coverage. So let's see if we can get the post route open. Um, he gets open, but it's man coverage. The whole purpose of having A and B come on over is just to clear out that side of the field. So you really do have about three, you know, if you want to count the in route, um, four options here. Right there, I was looking for the post, but it ended up not being match coverage.
get somebody fast like Tyreek Hill, that kind of stuff will happen all the time. So that's basically the play, guys. Um, you know, cliff notes on this. Basically, just read that cornerback that's on X. And then if you just don't like what you see, just drop it to your drag. That's the easy way to run this play. Some of you more advanced players, you can use all four routes. But right there, I mean, the the flat zone or curl the flat, whatever it was, is not going to get back there and help defend the C route. So I hope you guys enjoyed that play. Please drop a like if you did. And as always, if you enjoy Daily Madden Tips, please hit the sub button. Appreciate it, guys.